Hello, welcome to the 21 Day Challenge. We are here to um, combat complacency and apathy and downright laziness. And uh, we're gonna show up, we're gonna be attentive, we're gonna be intentional, and um, we're gonna really pay attention to the seeds that we sow. And today, I wanna talk to you about your eyes and how you see. Because we really have a filter um, over our eyes that through which we are looking at our mate. And um, yes, that could be through eyes of resentments from the past and maybe you really have been hurt. But I'm talking about something bigger than that. Just the general way you look at life and if you see it half full or half empty. So in the children's literature, the parenting literature that we find on the market in the last few years, there's been this little phrase popping up, catch your child doing it right. And that's just to bring a balance to um, criticism and how many things that you've caught Johnny doing wrong. And so learn to train your eyes to catch your child doing it right. And today I want to challenge you to catch your mate doing it right. And on top of that, if you can train your eyes to actually see it, see, oh, they did this today, they did that today. Um, if you could affirm along with that, then they know they were seen. This is called witnessing and being a witness to what this person does well and how they serve and the extra mile they may go for you. But when you, you can't really call attention to it unless you see it. So it starts with training your eyes to see it. And of course, in the big picture, we would think about this under the heading of becoming gracious, becoming full of gratitude. But you have to see it. You have to ask God to help you to see and to retrain your eyes, especially if they've been looking through a negative filter and they keep catching your mate doing it wrong. So today, um, ask God to help your eyes to see and then affirm what you see. Not as vain flattery. Believe me, they'll catch on to that really fast. Um, but what you really truly see and genuinely appreciate. Okay, have a good day.